God is good all the time and all the time God is good. I come before you this night very happy, very, very happy to give a testimony about my life. My name is Sister Elizabeth Jerry Deuri. I am the second born of a family of nine. And to say the truth, God has worked with me, and I can say that. Born in a humble family, grown like any other normal kid. And I studied in local schools, but I thank God that I was able to go to the best schools. The best school in secondary school, I was in the best school in Raikipia, that's Jojo Girls High School. And I went there, though the schooling was not easy because my parents were not able to cater for us. We were full of us in high school. And to know that it was not easy, four people, four children in the high school is not easy. And they could say we could be sent away for school fees and many other things that, that happened to us. And sometimes I could not study well, but I thank God that I finished the college school well. After I had finished, I got a good grade. I can see that it has enabled me to work in the ministry. And uh, after I joined the congregation in 2201 November, and after I was, I went through my formation, uh, the formation period of four years. Then I went out as a sister where I have worked in different communities. One is uh, started in Nalobi Westlands uh, for one year. Then I went to Alcalao School for Disabled where I worked for many years. I be, then I went to college. I was able to go to my teacher's college in Barigo. I pursued by certificate in P1. Then after I had finished, I worked at the same school. Then uh, I went to Italy for one year. I came back. Then I went back to Italy again, where I was to prepare myself to go to Portugal, where I went for some months, where I studied Portuguese in one of the best universities, the City University of Lisbon. I stayed in Lisbon for some quite some time. Then after I went back to Italy, I stayed there for a month. Then I, will, I went to West Africa in a country known as Guinea-Bissau, where I have been working for the past six years. But, but today I will not give the story about the Guinea-Bissau, but today I just want to speak about the testimony about myself. Then after six years, I came back when the COVID came. I felt that I was not able to go back because of the pandemic and I feared so much. So I stayed in Kenya until now I am here. To say the truth, the journey is not easy. It's sweet to be who I am, but we have to work on ourselves so that we can live our calling that's what we are called for and to be somebody who god wants us to be to say the truth being a teacher i have worked in schools that sometimes it has not been easy for me because of different challenges but i thank god until this far that god has brought me i thank god for my my family they have been so supportive then all of a sudden when I came back this year I lost my mother who was everything to me, my mentor, my any my confidence, any my confidence, all my my secrets I could tell her. Ah, it was a big bro, I tell you. But I told God, if you have taken my mother, you have to take that praise. And that's why I'm strong today to give my testimony to say that God is able. We were from a poor family, to say the truth, and people used to love after us. And they could say that we cannot be able to go ahead because we are just poverty-stricken family, where 
nobody had hope and they could say all kinds of things for a, the, a, against us some were not true they could add stories and could say that our mother is having many children that she cannot take care of them other things that they could say that we will not be able to go up to courage but to their surprise god has been faithful to me i've been able to pursue all these and he has also given me the grace i can say a favor that undeserved goodness of god that i am who i am today a woman of god convinced of serving the lord with a purpose and that's why my dear friends i invite you this night to support me by always subscribing to my channel like comment and also click that button and god will bless you because i know i have a mission that i, I need to accomplish unless you support me this mission cannot be realized and i want to be a full-time youtuber and i want to ask you my dear ones as i have that grace that god has given me to preach the word of god support me just subscribe i need just 1000 subscribers so that i can be able to go live now i cannot be able to go live i just post some videos some some of them they are not interesting but for the sake of the gospel i don't need anything about money or what but only one thing that i am asking subscribe to my channel so that i can be able to go drive and yani i exercise my dream i exercise my dream i know god has a purpose for us and he loves us the way we are so my friend in christ i love you so much and i thank god and i'll give next time i'll give testimony about guinea bissau stay tuned and i wish i could give it live so that i can even answer the questions for those people who are asking me questions so that i can be able to answer them so my dear friends subscribe comment like and god will bless you have a nice time